Didn't know you were doing yoga this morning, huh? <laughs> I took I took this down so nobody kicks it and knocks oh, good and, idea. and messes it up. So and then once we uh, once we get somewhere, it may be better. To... Uh -oh. <laughs> I'm okay. Put your leg, put your foot in there. Swing your leg over. There you go. Now swing your leg. There you go. Swing the other leg in. Perfect. Professional. Here comes the ballast. I want to be as far away from that thing as possible. <laughs> It feels warm though. <laughs> All right. Now Lee can grab some pictures of you guys if you'd like with your cameras or phone in the basket. Yes, please. Give him the camera. Yeah, I'm glad you didn't have a fifth one. Yeah. Did you have my camera? Oh, there. Yeah. He had to take it off so he went and kicked it. Okay, five eight six two. And then probably, honestly, you might be better off putting it up here. On that right one. There. And then that way it'll get some good view. Okay. Let's try and get some of the sunrise in the background. Oh, oh it is getting pretty. So, all right, guys, now we're going to go over how to stand when we land. Okay, so I'm going to get okay. you to move over this way, oh, okay. and I'm going to get you in front of your man there. Okay. All right, and then when we come into land, everybody's going to turn and face the van. Everybody turn and face the van right now. We're going to practice this. Everybody okay. turn okay. and face the van. All right. Anything you want to keep, arms, hands, fingers, inside the basket. Okay. All right, lean back. You can hold on to the top of the tank, the rope handles, if you're in the front. And then if you're in the back, just kind of lean back, bend your knees. When we come into land, okay? okay. So you're okay. gonna lean back, bend your knees a little bit like you're skiing, leaning back, holding on. Okay. See, when we land, we're gonna have a bump. Okay. That's why you're leaning back, have a little suspension in your knees to absorb the shock. Yep. Okay. Okay? okay. You guys all good? Yeah. Uh -huh. All right, you can go ahead and relax. Okay. <laughs> Does everybody know what they're gonna do when we land? Yes. Okay. <laughs> Did you wanna go right. in front here? Oh. Well, I'll see what way we're going first. I guess okay. that way. You guys <laughs> feel free to roam around. Go ahead. <laughs> yeah, well, Gonna need the hat. Just untie us. Just take untie us. Pull the rope out. Yeah, I don't think. I don't think I needed the hat. Right. It's well, just standing around waiting is the coolest. Sounds gonna be nice in here. Maybe. When we land on the freeway, just. Look down. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> All right, you see another balloon over there? Oh, yeah. See a couple other balloons oh, over there? Yeah. Oh. oh, I see two getting in place. Oh. Oh. Yep. They must all be together, maybe? Uh, no, they just all they all went out there. It's a nice muddy hole out there. So that's why we went on the blacktop. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now, do you have to wrap this part? No, no, the restaurant gives us permission. Uh, there's only a couple of us that have permission to take off in there. Mm -hmm. That's very nice. Yep. Yep. So now you guys can look out to the uh, east there. You can see the four peaks over there right now. Oh, yeah. Wow, wow, wow. Oh, yeah. Yeah. That's so cool. Uh -huh. You just float in this. 
Yeah. I can't look down. What? I said you I can't, can't look, look down. down. Just look out at the horizon. Yeah. Yeah. Did you want to? No, I'm fine. You're good. Nice All right, if you see me pulling on this green line or this black line throughout the flight, they open up rotation vents in the side of the balloon that cause it to rotate. Yeah. So that way there's not a bad seat in the house. <laughs> I don't think you could have got one more person in here, Harvey. Huh? Oh, well, well if we'd have had another person, we would have took a fuel tank out. <laughs> kind of good they're kind of like nice to have egg, be like a carton of eggs say so, uh then uh, if we have a windy landing then there's not a lot of room to bounce around there's several blues getting blown up over there mm -hmm. they're inflating yeah i only saw two before now i'm seeing one two three four five of them they're probably glad for some good weather to get up Oh yeah. Are they mostly private balloons? No, or, that's or all. Most, uh, uh, most uh, all of them except for two of them are big corporate balloons. Uh -huh. Corporate companies. They got, uh, some of them got 10 and up to 30 balloons. But they're about the same size. Yep. Where's the restroom in here? <laughs> uh, at the foothold. Yeah. <laughs> that was a good answer. What's, what's the longest flight you've been on? Uh, about two and a half hours when we flew over the Grand Canyon. Mm -hmm. We took off in Kanab, Utah and landed about 20 miles south of the Grand Canyon Airport. Now, did you have passengers? Or? Nope, just my wife and I. Two and a half hours. Yep. <laughs> How long did two and a half hours take? Miles. <laughs> that's what I yep. We did 98 <laughs> miles in two and a half hours. How long did that? She meant in minutes. <laughs> <laughs> well, we'd have to no, do that. No, I meant in miles. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> How many miles? Oh, you're 20. Two, two, 278 minutes, if you want to know exactly. Oh, okay. See, you do have the answer. Yep. Well, it wasn't really worth Did you pick out where you want to land? <laughs> On the ground. <laughs> Not at yep. And as the sun starts to come up, which like I said, I don't know how much, but it is a beautiful sky this morning. Yep. Got a little bit of color there with the clouds. There's a horse. You want to ride the horse? Or we can bring him up along with us. Yep. Pretty, isn't it, Daniel? Get pretty high up. 